I spent, uh, I guess I spent about a little over a year as the VP of marketing for Big Switch. Uh, and, you know, I, when I kind of first started it, our self-described mission was something along the lines of, uh, we build software-defined networking-style operating systems for bare metal switch hardware to power next-generation <coughs> packet brokers and leaf spine L2, L3 cloth switch switching fabrics. And, like, that means a lot to people in our industry. But it took us about 100 drafts to come up with something a little bit different. Uh, that something was, we believe that the network advances that have been made by Google, Amazon, Facebook, and Microsoft should be within reach of a much broader audience. Uh, it's, it was funny to see as we kind of converged on this, the external messaging is, you know, that kind of is what it is. Uh, that part worked very, very well. The interesting thing to me was the internal alignment. I gotta tell you, like people just seem more excited about coming to work. So it, it, it takes a ton of drafts to find one of these leadership statements that's not so high level and vague that it's meaningless. It's like a food bank, like a, you know, 10 blocks from my house. Uh, you know, it says like, our mission is to feed the world's hungry. Yeah. Food bank near DeBose Park in San Francisco. Like it's, it's a little bit of a mismatch. Um, and then it's really hard to come up with something that's not so detailed that it doesn't really resonate. So getting the, getting the right leveling there is something that takes drafts. And if you find yourself in a leadership spot and you're trying to articulate your own why, and you're trying to articulate your organization's why, I'd urge you to have patience. Take the time that, it, that it's going to require to do 100 drafts. And the end result of all of this work is probably very, very short. <laughs>